everyone, my name is Annie Lanteng from Proax Technology. Today we are with Fred Brassard from Fortress Interlock and we have some questions for you. Hi Fred. Hi Annie. One of my customers would like to know more about trap keys. Can you explain it to me? Excellent. Yeah, this is a great question actually. So let me show you. Trap key system is based on an industrial key. So this key is quite similar to the keys that you would have in the high-end systems. And in here, what you see is that there are different indentation on the key, which represent the way that the key was cut, obviously. And the way that is cut will actually give you the differ, which tells you which key will work with which lock. On this lock, for example, what we are showing here is the first function of a trapped key system, which is what we call the isolation. The isolation in a trap key system enables us, when you insert the key, to apply power to your machine. So you have electrical contacts here that would give you power. And if the key is not in there, power cannot flow. So effectively, the machine is stopped once you have the key out. You have different ways to isolate the machine. And this is another way that we would use. In this case, what you have is a pneumatic system. By inserting the key, I would enable air to flow through the units, which would then power a mechanism. The second function that we can uh, do with this type of key is a access function. So in this case, what we would do is we would use the key, let's say in this example, on a simple door lock. So this is made of two components. Obviously, this part here is the lock itself, which would be applied to the frame of the machine. And this part here is the actuator, which would be applied to the door. So this actuator would be attached through the holes that you see here, and it would swing with the door in and out. What you would do is when you close the door, you would push on the actuator and insert it into the door lock. This key is now an access key where it gives you access to the machine when you insert it in there. And as soon as you turn the key, it gives you access, but at the same time, the key is now trapped. Until the door is closed, it is not possible to get this key out. And until this key is out, you cannot power the machine again because you cannot bring this key to the isolator. The last function that we want to show you on this is a function of protection for your personnel. So by playing with the key here, I want to show you that this is a door lock with two locks. My access key would be inserted here, and when you insert it, it actually releases a second key. In this case, the function that you want to, uh, to do for your machine is a safety function. So I can take this key and put it in my pocket. And by turning this key, I liberate the actuator, which can then open the door. If I close the door, still I cannot take the access key out. The reason for this is that I have a special key, the safety key, which protects me. And until I bring that key back and insert it, I cannot take the access key out. The role of this key here is to protect me while I'm in the machine so that nobody could come behind me, close the door, and restart the machine while I'm in there. And uh, what if uh, my clients want to open multiple doors at the same time? This is a great question. The solution for us is to go with a different type of system here. So in this case, you could select an access key, which would be this red key, coming from the isolator, bring it to the unit, and by inserting it in the unit, you free two more keys. So this becomes an exchanger or a key exchange station where I take one key and multiply it by two, and each of those keys could then be brought to a door. It would become the access key for my system. And you could have multiple units here. It can go up to six units if you want. So theoretically, you can easily open up to six doors on one system. Thank you very much, Fred, for those explanations. If you would like to know more about those kind of products or if you have an application, please contact us and we'll be happy to help. Thanks for watching.